hello everyone in this video we are just going to discuss in detail about variables and the rules for declaring and defining variables in c language let's get started so we understood what are variables and how you can declare and define char data type variables and how these char data type variables are defined and how they are storing the data in their internal cpu and i hope you watched all those videos and you understood the basics of that and now we are just going to move on to the next part that is the variable naming rules so variables are nothing but a storage place in a programming language which is useful for storing a particular data and then retrieving back the particular data from the same memory so for any operation you can use this storage location by declaring and defining the variable based on your need based on the default data types available in c language and these variables are also called as identifiers because these variable names is identifying the memory location the identifier which is identifying the memory locations are nothing but variables and this is the basic syntax for declaring a variable as we declared the char data type in the previous uh, some of our videos and you can also declare a int based variable like this and these are all the rules for uh, naming a particular variable let's go to the first rules there are many rules but some of the basic important rules i am just going to point it out in this video so that you can keep in mind and you don't make mistake on that so first thing is the variable name should not exceed 30 characters so whatever may be the name as per your application as per your understanding you can make it as a variable name but it should not exceed 30 characters and the second point is a variable can have alphabets digits and underscore it can have alphabets digits and underscore you can use numbers in between the variable names and also you can use underscore symbol and the third point is a variable name can start with an alphabet and underscore only and it should not start with a number or digit that is I am just taking this program. Here the variable name is one. I can make it like this underscore one. Underscore one. It will compile successfully. Let me just make it underscore one. I am compiling it. You can see no use is found. But when I try to add a digit in front of the variable, let me just do that 5151. 5, 1. let me just compile this you can see i am facing an error that is the variable name should not start with a number it can start with a alphabet or an underscore so this is what the third point is mentioning and the fourth point is no white spaces are allowed within the variable that is you should not leave a blank space within the name of the variable you can provide an underscore or you can provide alphabets but you should not provide or even you can provide a digit in between two alphabets but you should not provide a white spaces between variable names and a variable name must not be any reserved keyword in c language that is there is some reserved keywords available that is nothing but this char is an example of reserved keyword and this unsigned is a, an example of reserved keyword in c language you should not use these kinds of reserved keywords in c language as your variable names other than that you can use anything as per your need and as per your uh, understanding in your program and a variable definition is declaration but not all variable declarations are definitions so for now i hope we are in the initial state of learning the c programming I hope you will not be understanding this point right over here for now understand that a variable definition is allocating a particular memory for that variable 
and variable declaration is nothing but telling to the compiler there is a memory called so and so. For now understand that these two are the difference between definition and declaration but later in one particular video I will explain you the difference between variable definition and variable declaration. Both are different. Definition is allocating memory in storage and the declaration is telling to the compiler that there is a memory called so and so. So I hope you learnt what are all the basic rules for declaring and defining variables in C language. Please remember these basic rules for declaring and defining variables in C language. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.